All right, so here's a run through of my, sorry about the lighting, I can't really do much about that. Um, here's a run through of my newly rebuilt uh, BK-466. It has the mod where I took the yellow wire out to disable the special circuit, so you don't need that stupid doohickey thing. Um, I currently have it hooked up to this tube. And we're going to go ahead and turn it on and start off. So adjust heater. I know that the heater voltage on this is 6.3. Looks like we're good. We're going to do a leakage test. Looks like I have no leakage. How about a G1 leakage test? Sweet, no leakage. Set G1 voltage. That is 50 volts. Looks like I'm just a little bit off. There we go. G2 cutoff voltage. That is number six. So we go up here, number six. And that should be set, that's on uh, red, blue. So we'll come down here and we'll adjust the red, blue. The cutoff would be right at the very end, right there. We'll switch it to green. And then blue. Right. <clears throat> and then we'll go to read emissions. Right now it's on the blue gun. I know this tube is good. Right now it's uh, reading emissions number seven. And we're gonna go to, what's on blue right now, we'll go to green. And it's good. And we'll go to red. And it's good. And we'll come down here and we'll switch this to color track. And we want to make sure it stays within, all three guns stay within that box right there. So we'll go one, it's on red, we'll go to green, it's on the high side but it's still there, and we'll go to blue, and it's still within the box. So we have good color tracking. Sweet. If we normalize, we can get them a little bit better. Green's a little high. There, we have color tracking. So that's all the functions. Um, I'm not going to do. Um, I'm not going to do the rejuvenate stuff. Um, because I know this tube is good. Uh, I already did it on my uh, BK490B, so I know it's good. But uh, yeah, um, yeah, all the mods I've done to it, it it works like a, any modern one should. Thanks for watching.